Hey there, I'm Brian Goulet of GouletPens.com and I'm here to introduce to you the seventh seasonal Edison Nouveau premiere that we have done. This is something we started, well, almost two years ago. Well, doing a seasonal color of a premiere. This is an exclusive color to us at Goulet from the Edison Pen Company on an exclusive pen model that we have available. And it's about every three months or so that we come up with a new one. So for 2015 summer edition, we have what we're calling Fireball. This is a hot red color. And if it looks a little bit familiar, that's because the material is actually the same as what was used in the Edison Hudson. And when it was previously called Ruby, that pen has since been discontinued for about a year or so. We have temporarily revived it for this pen. We've actually never done a red premiere before, with the exception of one that we did for uh, a, red, a red and black ebonite that was in late 2011. But other than that, never done a red before. So we're really kind of excited about this one. It's really different and stands out in the lineup of all of the other seasonal premieres that we've done. If you're not familiar with the Edison Nouveau Premier, it's a $149 pen that uses a number six size Edison nib that is made by Yovo in Germany. And the available nib sizes are extra fine, fine, medium, broad, 1.1 and 1.5 millimeter stub. All of these are stainless steel nibs that are smooth with a little bit of feedback, just enough so that you can help to control your pen while you're writing. If you've ever used an Edison pen before, it's the same nib that's available on most of their pens. One cool thing about the Edison pens is that the nibs are interchangeable. They're number six size nibs, so you have to get another number six, and Edison offers these separately from the pen in different nib sizes. So if you already have an Edison, you can swap out a different nib without having to buy a whole new pen. It's pretty easy to do. You just unscrew the housing directly out of the grip of the pen, or the nibs are friction fit inside there. You can just pull them on out. I have a separate video on that called Changing Edison Nibs. It's pretty old, but it still gets the job done. The material that's used for this pen is slightly translucent. It's made out of a cast resin and they're turned individually on a lathe and hand sanded and polished. So the quality is gonna be really outstanding. And because it's a little bit translucent, when you're looking through it, you can actually see the ink level a little bit as you're moving the pen back and forth, especially if you are using it in eyedropper mode. Because this pen is a cartridge converter, it uses standard international cartridges or converters, converters included, you can actually put a little bit of silicone grease on the threads and fill up the whole body with ink, converting it into an eyedropper pen. Very cool feature with most of the Edison pens. And if you're like me, you may wanna match up your ink to your pen. So I picked some good reds here that I think will go really nicely with your fireball. First one I think works really well is Diamine Wild Strawberry. This is a nice red, not quite pink, but on a lighter, lighter red that has some decent shading to it. Schaefer Red is another good one, classic bright red, great school color red, if you will. Uh, Diatriment is Poppy Red, again, very similar to those other ones. Noodler's Nikita as well, and Rower and Klingner Morinda. All of these reds are pretty similar to each, to each other and will pick up on some of the lighter or darker subtleties of the Premier. So that is the 2015 Summer Edition of the Edison Nouveau Premier Fireball. If you have any questions about it or if you have any feedback, opinions, I would love to hear it. You can post your comments on the blog or on YouTube. If you want more information about this pen, you can check it out on gouletpens.com. And if you like this video and you want more like it, you can subscribe to my YouTube channel. Thanks so much for watching and write on.